Hey. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Um, is Francis in? Oh no, no, he drove out not quite long. He's come for work. Okay. Um, actually, I'm looking for Julie. I have been calling her since last night, and she, her phone is actually ringing, but she's not picking. I, I, I didn't see her last night. Oh, uh, well, she did not come here. Oh, oh, oh. I, I, I thought she got married last week Saturday. Yes, and unfortunately, she lost her husband. What? Yeah, but she's been acting very funny since then. Oh, wow. So, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to hear funny. that. I'm sorry. Funny. But like I said, she did not come here. But trust me, when she comes, I will give you a call. Okay. Okay. And do take care of yourself. Thank you so much. All right. I'll be going. It's all right. It's all right. All right. She was coming to this place. Um, uh, yes. Um, no, hey! I, she... mm, they have done something to my daughter. No, Mama. My enemies have succeeded. No, Mama, it hasn't gotten to that. No, they no. have succeeded in killing my daughter. No, don't kill her! Mama, she's not dead. I didn't say she's dead. Uh. Um, don't worry, I know where to find her. I will, I will go to her room. You know where to find her? Yes, Can we go there together? No. Hey! Mama, Mama. I will, I, will, I will call her. Let me even call her. I think she should be there. I'll call you call her now. Call her here. Call, you I will come back. I will. Mama, I will come, Mama, I will come back. I will come back. You will come back? Yes, she should be in that girl's house. I forgot to tell you. Okay. Yes, ma'am. But why, why can't I just follow no, you? No, no, Mama, you cannot. Hey, she's, she's even refusing me following her. My enemies will never succeed. They will never succeed. They can never do anything to my daughter. They will never. They will never. They will never do anything. Okay, no problem. So where do I go to now? I don't even know where to go to. It's all right. Just take good care of her. Exactly. I saw her walking on the road like a mad woman. She lost her husband. What? When? He died the day after their wedding. And since then, she's been behaving strangely. Wow. Oh. So sad. What's up? I'm good. It's okay. 
Yeah, um, Annie was here today. She, she said she was uh, looking for <coughs> Julie. Why is your face like that? You needed to have seen Julie today. She was looking like a mad woman. Nothing is left of that girl. Oh, you saw her already? Oh, yes. I saw her walking like a mad woman along the road. Under the hot sun. Ah. That girl is going through a lot. She's too young to be going through this. I, I don't even know what to say. And but did you ask her what actually happened to the husband? Ah, uh, but she... Was it an accident or... But she, how can I ask her that type of stupid question? How? How do you expect me to ask her that? It's not fair now. All I know is that that girl is going through a lot. And I have to do something. I, 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 I must do something to help her. Hey, hey, hey. Don't know how start. No, no, start. I have to, have to, have to, have to. What do you want to do? You won't go where they bury the husband, go wake her up. But she had... But she, she's pained. Really? Yes, yes, she's hurting. I... <sighs> and bro, you were pained too. You were hurting sometimes ago. I mean, everyone hurts when something bad happens. Wait, who? What? Uh, um, Francis. Yes. <laughs> what? what? Tell me, say you want to start again. You want to start building this emotional thing again. Huh? Francis. Is that right? I'm very sure. You will get private work for psychiatric home. No, continue. You will lose big time. After, 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 after. Oh, God. You feel like the nicest things here. The shoes are mud. I'm thinking that maybe we should start shopping. Like, you know, there's no... Francis. Yes. What was the last thing I just said? Ah. Uh. Okay, so what's, what's wrong with you? I'm fine. No, no, you're not fine. You're not listening, you're not interacting, you're not saying anything, you're not fine. What is wrong? Darling, trust me, I'm, I'm perfectly fine. No, no, you're absent-minded. You're not following. You're not a part of the conversation. I mean, I just said, let's start shopping. That should be fun, but you weren't responding. So that means something is bothering you. So what? I think I have an idea. You're worried about the money for our wedding, right? Oh. You shouldn't be. I've saved a lot. I mean, I saved a whole lot. I mean, I've saved a little above 10 million now. What? Mm-hmm. 10 million now. Above. <laughs> oh my god. Yes, so you shouldn't worry. We should just start shopping. Thank you so much, darling. You are a lifesaver. <laughs> Thank you. What? Ten million? Above. <laughs> a little above. <gasps> Don't worry. I mean, we need to start planning and shopping because you think there's time and then you find out there's no time. The day is drawing closer and closer. Oh, yes. Shopping. I think we should start shopping now. I'll show you the shoe I saw. Exactly. <laughs> Hi. I hope this pleases you.
Thank you. You're welcome. How about we take a look? I don't feel up to it. Trust me, it's going to get ahead. Alright? Huh? Let's go. There's nothing wrong with loving someone, but it's terrible when you love the wrong one. Your heart and emotions will be tied with, yes it will, the decisions and actions will be affected negatively. You'll be manipulated, oh, and taking advantage of, yeah. Even when you find the one that's good for you, you may never know because you are blinded by fantasy love. You are blinded by fantasy love. Better love the one who loves you. It's the best thing to do. If you love the one who doesn't love you, they will end up hurting you. They will turn your world upside down and abandon you with regrets. There'll be confusion and commotion in your life if you love the wrong one. You will make wrong decisions, take the wrong actions just to please them. You could miss good opportunities, instead, you create animosities just to please them, just to please them. You'll make mistakes that you will regret. If you don't wake up to reality, it could be too late for you because you could end up losing it all, losing it all. Yourself to eat. No, no, no. Don't bother yourself. I'll be fine. I'm not bored with myself. Fans. I just want to make you happy. Hmm? You've done enough. You've been nervous since yesterday. Extremely nervous. Something bothering you? Ah. Uh. Darling, I'm not nervous. 
I'm fine. I'm, I'm just filled with joy. Uh, knowing that soon I will be your husband. Something I never dreamt of. You're kidding. And yeah, I was worried about you. Hey. This has been destined to be. Besides, you always knew how I felt about you. I mean, I never healed from the start. Right? Yes. <laughs> yes. And, um... I wish I had words to express my feelings for you. Um... I love you. I know. I really do. <laughs> I really know. <laughs> Besides, you make me so happy. And I'm excited that it's vice versa, you know. Also, we're going clubbing tonight. You need to meet some very important people in the city. Tonight? Uh-huh. Uh, why, why don't we make it tomorrow? You know? Why? You have an appointment tonight? Uh, uh, no, I... I just felt we need to spend some time together. I mean, <laughs> in the room. Oh, God, you and bedroom matters. We go to the club today because I want to introduce you to someone. All right. So club it is. <sighs> club it is. Awesome. Anything for you, darling. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> What's going on? Are you trying to sell this property? Who wants to know? Best, your late brother left this property for me. As far as I am concerned, you are not a part of my family. And you deserve no explanations to what I choose to do with my brother's property. Best, I am his legal wife. So I am his illegal brother. Don't make me angry. Get out of this place now. Is everything all right? Yes, yes, yes. yes. See, don't mind all these stupid scammers looking for who to scam. They are asking rubbish questions. Okay. Um, follow me, so I'll show you the back of this place. Okay, that back. You're going to like it. Okay. Yes. You see, you need to have everything you need to be in the world. slept off before I finished my dinner last night. And this morning you woke up, you're acting in front. What is I went to see the property Miles left for me. And I'm getting there. I saw his brother with a buyer trying to sell the property. I won't let that happen. I will go to court. Julie, you really do not want to go down this route with his family. I mean, they would think you got married to him because of his wealth. But I was the only one who accepted to marry him. I was the only woman who accepted to grant him his last wish, which was sitting by his side while he took his last breath. I deserve better. You know, now this whole thing is getting clear to me. Like, it's getting clearer every day that you have an ulterior meeting. Yes. Well, 
that is left between me and God. You do not expect me to sit down and do nothing while to take my late husband's property. Why didn't you fight back the day his brother asked you to return the car that he bought for you? He want to go to court to fight over a property you do not even have access to the documents. I will go to his mother. She'll give it to me. Okay. Um, I wish you all the best. I'm living for the best. But can you imagine? I saw Bex trying to sell the property miles left from me. Miles brother. The thing is, if he succeeds in selling this property, I will have nothing left. That's good. I would like to go with you when you're going. Why did you sell for properties? My friend, I asked you a question. I said, why did you sell for properties? What? You call me a madman? Fine. I'll show you what madmen do. Alright? I'll show you what madmen do. Francis, I still do not understand why you would go on such intervention with that girl. Eh? Why you don't know where and how they started? What do you mean of this now? Is this the right time to say these kind of things? Why will you try to make me feel bad now? Allow me, oh. Allow me, oh. You, you just collect this towel and start pressing my back for me. Can you just hear yourself talk? Huh? Just hear yourself talk. Okay, see, see what she has put you in. And why is she not here to see how you're doing, if your bones are still complete or not? I, I'm sure she's still trying to process what happened. She, she, she'll still be in shock. Why are you stressing yourself? Francis, did you say shock? Yes. My guy, you were beaten to stupor. You were beaten half dead. Thank God you survived it. And all you could say is she's in shock. Who told you that? Is, is that what I told you? Thank Who God told you I was, I was beaten? I was fighting, my friend. What are you saying? Stop this rubbish. <laughs> I was fighting to defend her. That's what happened. Just get your facts right. Huh? Wait, wait, Francis, I don't get it. This love thing don't scatter your head, though. Why do you hate this girl so much? No, tell me, I, I, because I don't understand. Why do you hate her so much? Every time when it comes to her case, you just, you just take it personal. Why do you hate her so much? Francis, I don't hate her. Francis, you are my friend, you are my guy, we stay in the same apartment. I mean, it's, it's, it's enough reason for me to show concern. Gucci, enough. I don't want to talk about this thing again. Eh? The best thing you can do for me now is go inside and, and get more hot water and, and, and bring, bring for me so I'll press my back. What's all this one now? Look, I'm, I'm, I'm only saying this, I'm only saying Please, this. I don't, don't say again. Please don't say again, I don't want. Don't say again. Ah. Francis, you either drop from one trouble to another because of this same particular girl. You know what I call it? Blessing in disguise. You think you just stay and then you just be blessed like that. Sometimes you go through through things now. You go through situations so that when the blessing comes, you, you appreciate it. And to me, this is how I see it though. I see this as blessing in disguise. Please just leave me alone. Let me, uh, let me suffer my suffer then. I'm sure very soon I'll enjoy my enjoyment. Okay, but, but I keep on saying this. Don't say I did not tell you. Don't Please say stop I did telling not me. Tell you. Stop telling me. It's all right. Help your own. I don't intend to put you through this. 
put me through through what? <laughs> Listen, you have to stop crying. All right? You know I hate to see you like that. <laughs> please stop crying. <laughs> Darling, please. <laughs> you don't understand. I'm so ashamed of myself. I'm so ashamed. Why would you be ashamed of yourself? <laughs> Did anyone tell you anything? Why are you not saying the word, darling? Talk to me. What is this about? I don't know if you're ready for this. Ready for what attack? What is it? You mean I'm, I'm going to be father? <laughs> You're not angry. Why am I supposed to be angry? Like this is the best news I've heard in the long while. You're going to be my wife, and I'm going to be your husband. Just get ready. I'll be right back. <laughs> Possibilities to. I know his mother will be very happy to hear the news that she will be having a grandchild. She will not have any grandchild. I don't understand. Are you going to keep this information from them? Why do not touch her? What are you saying? So who is responsible? The one responsible is aware. Who is there? Who is there? See, fate has fought us enough to put us in the right place. My love for you is immeasurable. So please, I ask you this question. Please, be my wife. She said yes. <laughs> Thank you, darling. Thank you so much. I love you. I love you too. I love you. I've always loved you. I don't seem to understand this. Julie, what for you? She's pregnant for me now. Francis. Hmm? How did you let that happen? Well. I've always loved Julie. You know that. I've never stopped loving her. Uh, okay, well, what happens to me? And the wedding plans? What happens to all of that? 
I don't know. Uh, I think we'll just find a way around it. That's all. Really? Yes. You find a way around it, you be wicked boy. Just go straight to the point. No, 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 no. Go straight to the point. Just say, I will break her heart. It's as simple as that. Look, after all that gay has done for you. <laughs> Bucci, why are you sounding like this? Huh? No, tell me, why, 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 are, you, why are you so so aggressive about the whole thing? Is, is it your problem? Is she related to you? Stop this, for God's sake. Stop it. Stop it, please. I don't like it. What she has done, what, what, what has she done for me? Eh? No, tell me, what has she done for me? Did I ask her for anything? You and I know that she did everything she did for me because of obsession. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Just hold it right there. A correction number one. Me and you don't know anything. Then number two, you be very wicked boy. In great time you be. No problem. No. Francis, so you can actually say this, huh? Eh? To a woman that gave you life. Francis, what? a woman that gave you life. What do you mean by that? Gave me which life? Is she God? How can you say a woman that gave me life? Do women give life? Why would you say she gave me life? Besides, if I was not handsome, she wouldn't have noticed me. Really? Uh, yes, really. Okay, wait. So as you there, so you fine. Now if they say me fine boy come out, because say you fine, and they say me fine boy is come out, now we, when we do fine, we know if he come out, now you go call come out. You know what? I will sit right here and watch you regret every actions of yours. God forbid. I'm not going to regret anything. Oh, really? Yes, I will not regret anything. What oh, was this thing you were saying about you being fine? I don't understand. Fine, how? I just, I just, I'm not telling you say like I fine, like I fine. I just tell you say I fine. I'm not, no it's my shit up. Then I leave, leave my fine like this. I was, see, but, I was Francis, worried. I, I know, I know it is your ploy. Not you again. You know, you they stay the same. I would share boxers sometimes. I know this is about Julie's late husband's properties, right? <laughs> but don't worry. Soon, I will leave this house for you. So I will not be counted among bad, bad, in fact, I don't know which I will talk. So that nobody they feast in and you do all these your dubious plans with the planner together. No problem now. If you like, you can go and live inside the bush. As a matter of fact, I need space. Since she's pregnant, very soon Junior will come. I'll need space in the house for my child to be running around. Mm, I need space. I'll start thinking about marriage now. I'm not getting any younger. It's not your fault. She, she because my sister will push. She's in my ghosty bush. See, because of that bush, she push. I mean, make it, you know, if you say anywhere, talk to my ghosty in a bush. It's a good thing you're running with it. <laughs> Jam bush. You can even start your own album with it. Mama? Yes. I will call you by the phone to tell you about her. But I decided to bring her to you. Mm. Ah, this is Julie. And as you can see, Julie and I are getting married. I don't understand. Mama, I said Julie and I are getting married, so. Mm. Let me take you to, to my room, okay? So you can relax and have a child. Alright? Okay. Mama, I'm going yeah. back. What's the meaning of this? Why were you looking at my wife like that? Do you know I'm from somewhere? Did I hear you say it? Yes. My wife. Are you stupid? Oh, now, why would you ask me? About are you a stray dog that doesn't know what you want? I might know what I want. Do not think you came home here. With me, and now you're here with this girl. I'm telling me what I don't understand. What is it that you don't understand? I just told you, mm -hmm. Julie and I are getting mad. It's simple. Don't you get it? You're either mad or you're a stray dog. Mama, enough with the names, please. What is wrong with you? Why would you call me a stray dog? I just told you. Are you mad? Is there anything wrong with your head? Mama, you slap me. And I will slap you again. 
better go to that your womb and take that girl out of this house. Out! What I will do to her, you will live to remember it. Nonsense. what you're about to do is right. You just lost your husband a few weeks ago and you want to do this. Listen, if your mother-in-law does not support this, your mother will not support this. I do not care what my mother feels about my decision. But you don't want to have an illegitimate son. Fine. But why not just wait? At least people are still mourning. Give people time to mourn. I'm just begging you. Annie, I respect you a lot. And I do not want to lose our respect. This is my decision. And if you're not going to support me, then you shut up. Okay, but at least before I shut up, can I make a proper suggestion, please? You can travel with him somewhere else, relocate, go to another town, another country, just do something, but leave this place. What are you doing here? See, why don't you get married? You have no right to come to my house uninvited. Really? Since that night we met at the bar, you have refused to pick my calls. Didn't you enjoy the time we spent together? That night was a huge mistake. Each time I remember it, I regret with everything in me. Really? Huge mistake. A huge mistake. And yet, you scream my name out loud. What have I done to myself? Done to myself. What have I done to myself? Done to myself. See what I've done to myself, done to myself. Oh, see what I've done to myself, done to myself. What have I done to myself, done to myself. And maybe lost the one who truly loves me, the one who's been there for me, the one that's really meant for me, really meant for me. Yet you followed me from the bar to the top, just to enjoy what you've missed for a long time. Here you are, talking rubbish. Bobby, I am trying so hard not to insult you. Leave this place. Enough of this nonsense. Get out! I launch your pregnancy. Mm -hmm. Why do you want to give my child to another man? I have no idea what you're talking about. No clue at all. A cousin of mine works in the same hospital where you did your pregnancy tests. So I asked again. Why do you want to give my child to another man? What makes you think the baby belongs to you? John. My man can equally perform. So this baby is his. Don't lie to me. Do not get in peace. Don't get out. Get out. Out! I am old enough to know who got me pregnant, and I say it is not you. Leave! One million naira, no leave. I'll never bother you again.
But failure to do that, I will hang around until the day of the wedding. You know what that means? Excuse me. So, damn! What have I gotten myself into? No, 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 this is not good for me. This is not good for me. Oh yes, Adam. It's going to be in two days. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know, I know. The special one. <laughs> no problem. No problem. Be happy for you. Let me call you. Hi. So it's true. I was planning to come. At what point were you going to tell me? To what end? What? At what point were you going to tell me the truth? So what happens to me? What happens to my emotions and everything? I'm sorry. I just realized that just I still don't. love her. You still love her? And, and you couldn't tell me? I ask again what happens to me and all the wedding plans and everything. Don't. Just don't. You have done so much and you have always gotten away with it. On this one, you will pay for this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? solve it as soon as possible. Well, well it will be late if I get the money for you tomorrow. No, 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 you can do transfer. Transfer the money right now. I, I, need, I need to solve something, like, right now. I, I know, I know. The problem now is I'm expecting some money from the client tomorrow. So not to worry, if he makes the payment tomorrow, I'll just I'll send the money to you. Okay? All right? So what do you need the money for? My mother, she is sick. She's booked for an operation on Monday. Please help me. I don't want her to die. Please. Please. Please, Abike. The thing there is that, you know, I'm finishing up my house. And currently, as we speak, I don't even have up to 200000 in my account. Abike, please. I don't want her to die. She has suffered a lot. Please help me. I will pay back. I promise I'll pay you back. Hmm. Please help me. Help me, please. Okay, please. 
Actually, there's a woman that lent my auntie some money some time ago. It's because of you. I could tell my auntie to talk to her. Hey, thank you. If, if you do this for me, I will be so grateful. Okay, Please help okay. me. I promise it's I'll okay. pay you back. Oh. It's okay, it's not okay. Just let me, let me even get my answer before. Hey, I'm thank you. Thank you it's so okay. much. It's thank you. Now. It's for you. Just because thank it's you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, I'm a big guy. So, my madam, I did. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know, let's go inside. To call it no, I know. It's the figure switch. It's coming down. Uh, um, sorry, let me answer my sister. I'm coming, please. everything to gather this money and give to you. You know things are very rough for me right now. Obi, what you're doing is not fair. It's not fair. aunt called and she was really worried so I told her to come down and that I was going to help in whichever way I could best. But actually you know about me it's for my neighbor her mother is sick and she needs money for surgery. And she did not come with you? She came with me um she got a call I think she's talking with her sister. I said I'm going to give you the money why why, why are you using this blackmail to hurt me? Hello? Hello? Bobby? Oh, okay, that's, that's fine. That's fine. So here's the money. Ah, oh, okay. thank you very much. You're so kind. <laughs> it's nothing, thank really. Thank you. Let me get you a drink, right? Thank you. Thank you. That's all. You? Uh, Julie? Yes? Who are you? My name is May. I was engaged to Francis. I am engaged to Francis. I mean, we were planning to get married and all of a sudden he comes back to me and says he wants to go back to his ex. So, do you have a problem with that? Yes, I mean, no, I mean, I mean, after everything, do you really love him? Or you just want to 
use him to heal yourself. What sort of stupid question is that? Well, he's simply tired of being a sugar boy to a sugar mommy. So if he dumps you, it simply means he is tired of you. Wait, no, wait, you... You just called me a sugar mommy. Of course. Uh, isn't it obvious? Sugar mommy. No. Excuse me. No, wait, no, I'm not, I'm... Wait, no, I'm... I'm not, not sugar mommy. So you really intend to use my money to plan your wedding? You? You? Abike, why didn't you tell me she's the one? I don't understand. You guys know each other. Why, well, yes we do. Because she called me a sugar mommy. No, don't, don't bend your head. Don't bend your head. That's what you said. You called me a sugar mommy. You don't love him anymore, but you just want solace. So go ahead and enjoy yourself. Abike, take her out of my house. Before you do that. Wait, wait. Wait, I'm going to be supposed to Let's go out. Let's go out. Abike, you have tried. Maybe it is time for me to pay for my sins. I don't understand. Maybe if you tell me what's going on, I might actually bring a solution for you. Don't worry. You've done well. Thank you. Julie. Julie. Man, I'm just so confused. And peace of God be unto this house. Yes. And um, please, who are you? Drama queen. With a nice drama. Young man, she asked the question. Who are you and why are you here? Okay. I am looking for my sweetheart. And her name is Jenny. Excuse you? Who is your sweetheart? I mean, I, I, who are you looking for? How can you call me your sweetheart? Do I know you? Should I tell you? Hey, 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 hey. Hey! What exactly is going on here? What's going on? I'll tell you. I want to. Ah! Oh, my back. Oh, my right. back hurts. What? Ah! I want to ask you this question. Before I was rudely interrupted. Now the question. My mom, my mom is spending me here. Here, here. My mom, my mom. Would it be fair if you allow a woman takes your child to another man? Would it be fair? This young lady here is carrying my child. Excuse I'm me. I'm sorry. Um, sorry? What did you say? She says this is a madman. A madman just walked in here talking trash. What are you talking about? A madman? What, what are you talking about? What is he talking about? I don't even know. Okay, 